So I'm Sheila. I'm elected in Nanaimo. I work with Kelly. She's elected in Chilliwack, and we together serve in the BC Legislature. She's a very hard worker and uh, very powerful woman. I'm very lucky to have her as your voice in the legislature. And I also have an assignment from Premier Evie to be responsible for what's called social development and poverty reduction. We look after all uh, PWD income assistance, we have a poverty reduction strategy, and also CLBC sits inside our ministry. And last year we funded all together uh, for this program uh, $140,000 to learn what we can about the connection of employment and uh, the good things that happen when people have some kind of a job or volunteerism or programs that the participants and the staff here wanted to do. It was part of the bigger program, which was uh, $2 million that all together was helping to train 360 youth across BC in different communities. And this was a part of that, 36 people that participated in that. Anyway, that's all just mechanics of what is great for me is like a year after making that announcement of that funding, then I get to come back and visit and talk with people directly about what kind of things are they working on, what's important to them, and what actually happened with a program like that. Then we learn from it. And then we tell other communities, like I'll say, you know, I met these people, Nick told me this cool story about a project that he did, or the workers will say, this didn't go as well as we expected, and maybe we'll learn from that and build that into the next time. So Kelly wanted me to come and hear from you about um, kind of the power, importance of work, importance of connecting with sport, um, or just any of the good things that are happening in Chilliwack, and then also you know the things that we still need to work on. That's why mm -hmm. I'm here all ears. So mm -hmm. we're really glad that you invited us in, that you brought cookies and uh, <laughs> beautiful flowers, and it's like the nicest day in Chilliwack you could imagine, <laughs> blue sky, and yeah. and we're just here to you know hear some of your stories and know that if you tell me some cool things that you've done, then you might just hear me sometime in the legislature telling a story about Chilliwack and people that I people that I met and um, and the uh, ways that you are working and supporting each other. Does that make sense? Right. So that's our that's our motivation here. And I wonder if anybody's got stories about um, the ways you've been doing some of these cool projects together and things that we should know. I think Nick might have a story about something that we've been working on for a little while now. Do you want to take the lead on that? Just about um, exploring with the uh, Canucks Autism Network? Um, yeah, yeah, hold on. I'm trying to put this into a story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, you. yeah. So maybe start with which year did you do impact? When did you, what summer? Okay, I'll start with that. So, yeah, mm -hmm. I started with um, impact uh, last year in 2023. Uh, I think it was um, during the fall. Was it? Yeah. It was, it was uh, from June to June to August. Yeah. Yeah, June to August. Mm -hmm. I started with impact from June to August, mm -hmm. and um, sorry. So yeah, I started with Can from June to August. So, uh, impact. Impact. Yeah. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Impact. Impact. And then um, yeah. So we worked on yeah. lots of uh, lots of different skills. One of the big things that we noticed in all the different workshops, uh, especially for me as a vocational counselor, was Nick's incredible ability to have leadership and compassion for others. And I was like, dude, you gotta, you gotta work with others. Like, you'd be such a good coach. And so we started working on those employment skills and eventually applying to uh, Canucks Austin Network. Where, do you wanna tell them what, uh, what you're doing at there now? I'm basically an assistant coach, just helping um, to <clears throat> just helping other people with participants. Mm -hmm. I'll email all the employees there with um, participants. I show I help them by showing my compassion, my participation. Mm -hmm. I manage to show them how well I can help them out mm -hmm. uh, with other participants. What do the participants do there? Uh, <coughs> sorry, what, do what do the participants do? 
do there. Um, basically, the participant meaningfully. Oh, yeah, they exclude. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah. I, I like them. I think you should have done always come up with the answers. Oh, good buddy. Anyway, <clears throat> so anyway, as I was saying yes for what he just said, mm -hmm. I helped them, I helped the participants out with swimming. I helped the employees train them to swim. Mm -hmm. I've done amazing work. I have even had to do a couple of demos a few times, I think. Mm -hmm. But it went all, went all so well. And the way I showed a participant or two helped them really learn how to swim very fast. Very fast. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What kind of extra training?